the under 52 kilo division enjoyed the privilege of having two Olympic champions. In addition to Uta Abe, Istria Krasniki was a gold medalist at under 48 kilo, Moradis at under 52 kilo, and still with Justin. In Zagreb, the Grand Prix final was taking place. The Japanese team participation in the tour continues. Ute Abe is back in sparkling condition this time, making her first international outing since she won the Olympic gold medal this previous year. Last week in Budapest, her brother won at under 66 kg, and now she appears to be doing the same. They are both exceptional judokas, and it's breathtaking to witness two Olympic winners side by side. Abe hit Osakomi after hitting Wasari. Her victory, the second for Japan in Zagreb, served as a message to the rest of the world, starting with Krasniki. Field, dominating their opponents up until the semi-final, where they both slightly slowed down but still at hand. In their lone prior encounter, which took place in the under 52 kg quarter-final of the Perry Grand Slam in 2018, Krasniki fell to Abe. Now the distinction is that both of them are Olympic champions. They were eagerly anticipating this. We replicate what the audience wants to see. No one desired it in round 1, and since they were ranked 9 for Abe and 10 for Krasniki on the world rank list, and were separated by fewer than 100 points, our dream was realized in the championship match. The fact that Uta Abe doesn't waste time is a plus. In her first World Judo Tour match, after the Olympics, she destroyed Canadian Kelly Deguchi in 30 seconds. The Japanese performed similarly to her brother in Budapest in Zagreb, letting everyone know that the Olympic winner had landed with the same determination and incredible technical skill. Abe rushed over the Brazilian Taba, followed by the Moroccan Sumaya Irui and stood in the same final, averaging less than two minutes of actual tatami time over the course of three battles. The fourth victory came against the deserving Swiss opponent, Fabian Kocher, after only four minutes. Despite her combativeness, the Swiss never gave off the impression that she could defeat the Japanese, which was expected to result in Abe's victory. Uta Abe knew Krasniki well and, despite the fact that she belonged to a different weight group, attentively and effectively analyzed her.
ultimate final between two Olympic winners, Ute Abe defeated Dystria Krasniki. Abe remarked after winning the gold medal in Zagreb that despite appearing on numerous TV shows and other occasions during the Olympic Games, her lifestyle and dedication to judo were unaffected. She and her brother are two of the most well-known siblings in Japan, and they have lived happy lives. However, right now, all eyes are on her as she prepares to win her second Olympic gold medal in Paris. <laughs>